My name is Ryan Kreschel. I'm a doctor here at Wellia Health. I work in both the clinic and hospital settings uh, where I have treated patients with COVID-19. One of the questions I get a lot um, as a doctor is, you know, this vaccine was developed so quickly, how do I know it's safe? Um, and that's a really good question. Um, because you're right, the vaccine was developed really quickly. Um, luckily for us, the scientific groundwork for the vaccine had already been laid um, with some previous epidemics, like in 2003 with the SARS epidemic. Um, and so uh, luckily we didn't have to wait years for, um, to, to learn that technology. Also, uh, there's a lot of international collaboration um, in, in coming up with this vaccine. Um, and there was a great urgency to save lives. This needed to happen fast because, because lives are on the line. Uh, uh, that combined with some unprecedented funding worldwide um, really did make this vaccine something that it was created quickly. Um, and you know what I tell patients is, thank goodness it was created quickly because it saved a lot of lives. A lot of patients have questions about the side effects of the uh, COVID shot. Um, when I got my COVID-19 vaccine, um, I didn't have any um, side effects. Um, I had a little bit of a sore arm perhaps for a half a day, but felt really well both with the first and the second shot. Um, I know that's not true for everybody. Uh, I do have family and friends that uh, had more side effects, especially with the second shot. Um, and we've come to know that that's pretty common. Um, main side effects uh, are things like a headache, maybe some body aches, um, just kind of flu-like, not feeling quite right for about a day, maybe two days. Um, and that isn't uh, to say that the vaccine is doing anything bad to your body. It's really your immune response, really kind of accepting that, uh, that shot and, and really gearing up its immune response. So it's not a bad thing. So the nice thing about uh, science is that there's always scientific observations that are ongoing. Um, as of right now, there don't appear to be any long-term side effects of this, vaccines, uh, of this vaccine. Um, what I worry much more about would be the long-term effect of the COVID virus or having COVID or being unprotected from the virus. Um, I've seen and treated patients with COVID-19 um, and the potential long-term damage to that patient's body or their lungs um, has me much more worried than does long-term effects from a vaccine to prevent that disease. When the COVID shots first came out, I had a hard time finding fault with people that had kind of a, you know, ah, you get your shot first mentality. Um, I think that's human nature, um, and I understand where they're coming from. Um, Fast forward now several months um, where we have somewhere around 50% of the U.S. vaccination, uh, U.S. population with at least one shot. Um, it's really clear that this shot, it is safe. Uh, perhaps more importantly, it is efficacious. It works. Um, and so um, now that we have this clear safety uh, and efficacy data, um, I think it's time that we, we do our part for our communities and, and get vaccinated.